All right, everyone, hello and welcome back. It's been a whole two minutes. So here is my package from Kim. I did not know she was sending this. But I need to send her a package because honestly, she always sends me shit and I never send anything back. I have stuff set aside. I'm really good at that, but I hate going to the post office and I honestly hate going outside right now. Ugh. So like our son is tall, he grew like a freaking weed over the last few months. We had to get him new clothes. We had to go into this store. My husband, myself, and the workers there were the only ones that were wearing masks. It's gross. Anyways, she sent, me, she sent me this package, and it was so sweet because, and I'll show you exactly why she sent it. This is Vintage Chic Scents, The Wishing Tree, and Count Your Blessings Over Pour. Go, she put go fuck yourself on there. She, she's such a bitch. This is my favorite favorite scent. It's so pretty and I love melting this all around my house, in my bedroom, everywhere. And I think this was the last of what she had, so I'm gonna, when I, I'm able to get my loaf, I'm gonna give her a nice slice of that and I'm gonna send, I'm gonna send her a package. I have to. I, I can't be that person that doesn't, I, I have not gone to the post office in so many months. I honestly, God, what, the last time I went to the post office was to mail Crystal her round robin box, and then I had a bunch of um, vendors that she liked put in a in a box, which is actually still sitting right over there under my desk that I was going to send her, and I haven't because that's how much I hate going to the post office. For one, it's like it's fucking expensive to send a box, and it's hard to always fit things in a flatted or flatted a flat rate padded envelope. <clears throat> so you have to like move up and figure out your boxes and I don't have a printer here that works we've got one it's new but it's just like my phone won't connect none of my phones will connect nothing connects so I can't use the damn thing so I have to go there I have to write it in hope to god it makes it where it's supposed to go because my writing can be really shitty depending on what I'm if I'm in a hurry or if I'm like writing with something crappy it's a whole fucking thing I hate but I love this blend. This is beautiful. It smells like a fabric softener and it's just so pretty and it's got this sweetness to it. There's clove or something in here. I was reading the description when Kirby put it up and I just wouldn't have, ex I wouldn't have ordered it because of the scent description, but it really has a meet me in St. Louis vibe. but with something else. It's so damn pretty. And it is strong. Like, Meet Me in St. Louis is not strong. I can smell it pretty good in my bedroom. So I actually put all of that scent in my bedroom. But this one I can put in my living room, the kitchen. It just, it smells everything up. Okay. And then she sent me a bunch of other stuff too because she's Kim and she's kind. This is a half of a chunk. I, Kim knows I like to melt, like, full things. But we'll see. I'm going to try it. This is L3 Clothespin Strawberry Sugar. I have been wanting, this was open, so if this doesn't throw, that might have something to do with it too. In fact, two of the, two of the best ones were open, Kim. No, I'm just kidding, this is free, so I'm not going to complain, but, what is on there? It's like a booger or something from, from Kim. Mm hmm No, I actually don't know what that is. Oh, it's wax. And glittered wax. This is really pretty. I don't know that I've ever smelled clothespins. So I definitely get the hype. I can smell the strawberry sugar. I'm excited to try that. I'm going to actually do that now. Uh, this is strawberry milkshake and summer breeze. It was a custom blend that Kim made from K's. I do enjoy K's. And K's is really affordable. I don't know why I haven't ordered from her. This is nice. It's you definitely get that like the laundry scent and a a creamy strawberry. I'm excited to try that one. The bathing garden also. Can we just discuss how the bathing garden has never raised her prices? Nothing. That kind of makes me want to just go order from her now. Uh, this is keep your temper. Fresh lemon curd. No, lemongrass, lemon curd topped with marshmallows. Is that... Oh, yeah, you get the lemon curd and the lemon uh, grass the most. 
This is Rose Girls, Jenny's Perfect Sunday Morning. I don't have any idea what this is. I thought it was a coffee blend, but... Maybe there is somewhere in there, but I feel like I get a really strong... I don't know if it's clove. Some spice. I'll have to melt that and see how that is. This one was open too. It's uh, the Winged Mermaid from Vintage Chic Scents, Shimmering Blue Lagoons, and Salty Sea. Oh my God, Salty Sea Air and Coconut. This is really, really pretty. <clears throat> and this must have been a loaf. I love this one. I love it so much. And <clears throat> if, I know this throw. So if it doesn't, it's because the bag was open. Because that one is amazing. All right, I forgot I can pause you and I hack my lungs out. Vintage Chic Scents, Meet Me in St. Louis. So this is warm vanilla sugar, brown sugar, figs, and glistening snow. This is like that fabric softener scent that I am obsessed with. Which I can't believe she sent that to me because I think I told her I had some. Or maybe she just doesn't get the throw that I do. Because I don't get a throw. I mean, it's really hard for me to get a throw with that one, honestly. But in my bedroom, it works good. Uh, Rainbow Melts out of the shower. This is shampoo, Dove, and White Clouds. This smells really good. I really like soapy scents. But this doesn't smell soapy. It's very, very clean. Like, this is perfect for a day that you, like, just got done cleaning your house and you want your house to, like, have that extra cleanliness to it in the air. She gave me a lot of this. Elm Street and Dracula and Vanilla Smoothie. I do not remember what Elm Street is. Oh, it's that, uh, oh, this is so good. This is that, like, I don't know if it's caramel or butterscotch blend uh, with Tiffany candles or... Scarlet Rose, whom I also need to place an order with. I love Tiffany. I love her wax. I think it's changed, and I've been kind of scared to try it. But she has some really great blends. She's got my favorite Rosemary Mint, and I like her stuff, so I need to do that again. I don't know why I've not been doing it, honestly. She is still open. I know I saw someone wonder that, but yeah, she's definitely open. This is just a really good bakery. Caramel Gooey Bakery, which will be nice in the fall. It's getting hot here, so there's a card Kim sent me. I'm not going to read that because it's totally inappropriate. This is Pop Art Lemon Cake topped with sweet blackberry ice cream. This is a really nice blackberry lemon scent. I don't think I've had this one, so I'm excited to melt that. Very lovely birthday cake. I was actually watching Kim's melt video, and I, I was shocked to learn that there's blackberry butter jam in here. Cookies, I'm going to... And yes, oh my gosh, now that she says that, I can pick that out, but I never, I could not before. Like, when you know there's something in a blend, you do pick it out most of the time. Or if you hate something, you always pick up the scent that you don't like the most, like, regardless. But I can totally smell it now that I know. Before, it just smelled like a berry, like a blackberry, a strawberry, blueberry blend to me. Now it's... Now it's all screwed up and I'm wrong. <laughs> I went through like five bags of that, so I'm kind of sick of that scent, but I will melt it. Just not until next fall. This is Vintage Cheeks uh, Scents, Chef Wendell's Cinnamon Sugar, Apple Cinnamon, Ice Cream Man, and Nilla Wafers. I have a friend who might like this. I don't know if I will. Oh, that is good. Yeah, it's not strong on the cinnamon. It's just a really nice bakery scent. This I wanted to get, and I was so sad that I didn't, but now that I'm smelling it, uh, this is Rainbow Melts Whip It, frozen pineapple chunks, and sweet coconut milk. Oh, I thought it was, uh, okay, never mind. I thought it was uh, sugar milk. I definitely get the Dole Whip, and I do get that coconut milk or that creaminess. It's... I can't say if it's sour or not, because I really had it in my head that it was sugar milk, so that made it automatically sour. I'll have to melt it. 
but I wanted to get this one and I didn't. And I think I wanted to get this one also and I didn't. This is Coastal Mist, Sweet Citrus, Salty Air, Juniper, Sea Moss, Teakwood. It sounds like something I would get. So maybe I didn't see this order. I don't know. This one is beautiful. This actually smells more soapy than the Dove. But I feel like you get that um, juniper, the teakwood, all that good stuff. It just it smells soapy when it's blended together, and I'm totally fine with that. So that is my package from Kim. Thank you, Kim. You might get a package from me. When? I don't know. Next year, next week. We'll see. <laughs> all right, guys. I'll see you uh, with one more haul and then finally my melts.